crazy. I saw Walt in the jungle just before Shannon was shot. Does that make me crazy? Now the two of you seen him. And you get to lay there every night and listen to him doing your mom right there in your daddy's old bedroom. And even that wouldn't be so bad if he didn't beat her up all the time. He come knocking on your door late at night? He never touched me. <laughs> horse! That was a horse, right? That ran by? It was real quick, so I'm not sure on that. <laughs> Well, don't just sit there. You're trying to make a break for it. Why sit there and stare at a horse? Mind if I check out some of this hardware? Sure. Do you know computer don't stuff? Break it. I have something I think you should see. I will begin at the beginning. Long before Christ, the king of Judah was a man named Josiah. Boy, when you say beginning, you mean... <laughs> on the other side of the island we found a place much like this they had a but book in, in there place, we found a book I believe what's inside there will be of great value to you why is there hole? oh and more film Right? Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. No, who is this? That's the same last name as her. Is that her dad or something? Like her actual dad? Why didn't you tell me, Dad? Tell you what? I was making a scrapbook. A surprise for your birthday. The pictures that he sent me had dates on the back. Photos of you in Korea. Up until four months before I was born. Why didn't you tell me the way it was my father? So she killed her dad. You were five years old. I wanted to take you along with me. She wouldn't let me. Aww. So why didn't you kill him? Because I don't have murder in my heart. Aww. He thinks the dad spirits in his Sawyer. You asked me why I, why I did it. It's because I hated that you were a part of me. That I would never be good. That I would never have anything good. And every time that I look at Sawyer, every time I feel something for him, I see you, Wayne, and it makes me sick. That's about the sweetest thing. Wayne. This seems so random, this thing. <laughs> we saved. I was Sawyer. We crash. Two halves of the same plane fall in different parts of the island. You're over there, I'm over here. Now, here's the missing piece right back where it belongs. Don't mistake coincidence for fate. Watch yourself. <laughs> Maybe I'll take me back inside. Do you see the horse? Yes, he does. You see that? You mean the big ass horse standing in the middle of the jungle then? Yeah. <laughs> know that horse freckles sort of i mean not that yeah, I exact horse but you sure you want to waste that on me I figured you could use a drink you're gonna try to convince me that everyone here doesn't hate me only if you're gonna try to convince me that every woman in the world's not crazy attempting to use a computer in this 
manner will compromise the integrity of the project and, worse, could lead to another incident. I repeat, do not use a computer for anything other than entering the code. What is that dinging? Hello? I'm gonna shit myself if it says it's Walt. <laughs> So that's the end of episode nine. Um, so this was another Kate backstory. Um, we found out what she did, why they were um, that that Marshall guy was trying to track her down and take her back to wherever the hell it was he was taking her. And she killed her dad, which makes like the stuff he was saying and the, and the way he was looking at her really nasty. If it's gross before, like if it had been like your stepdad or something, that'd still be gross. But um, now that we know that he was actually like her biological father, it's just even nastier. Um, but he or she killed him. She blew him up. She made sure he was at his home or her mom's in his home and uh, blew him up. So I kind of saw it coming. I was waiting for it. Like I said, I was waiting for it. I just like, it kept focusing on the house. I'm like, okay, is like, the house going to like blow up or something? And sure enough, it did. I didn't say that out loud, but it's what I was thinking. Um, and then she went to her mom and told her mom that she took care of it, um, that she took care of him. And she like had taken an insurance policy out in the house so, so that not, her mom wouldn't have anything to start over with, you know? Um, because, you know, she did blow up her home. She, like, had nowhere to live. Uh, so, but her mom ended up turning her in. And, um, yeah. So, I guess she just really loved the guy. She didn't care the way he treated her, the way he looked at her as daughter. Uh, and, unless she didn't know. I mean, I don't know how she probably wouldn't know. I'm sure she did. Um, but when she was on the run, she... She got caught. They set up a um, sting operation, I guess. I don't know what you want to call it, at the train station or bus station or wherever it was. And um, she got arrested. And he was, the marshal was driving them back in the rain. And a horse, a black horse ran out in front of her or them and it caused the car to crash. And that allowed her to get away. And Kate had been seeing this horse on the island. She thought she was going crazy. Um, so, yeah. So, we know what she did. So, but she said she didn't... She said she didn't do it when... Okay. The whole talking to Sawyer thing was really weird. It was... Just didn't really make any sense to me. Why she thought Wayne... Dwayne, whatever, was in Sawyer. Because... Uh, Sawyer wasn't dead. It didn't really make a lot of sense. Just because he said, why did you kill me? Yeah, it didn't make sense Sawyer said that, but I don't know how she came along the lines that her dead father was asking her that question. Um, But she said she didn't kill him because that he hit her mom or the way he looked at her or anything. She just did it because she couldn't stand the fact that, you know, he was a part of her. Like, she came from him. So, uh, yeah, there's that. She also, like, during her freak out after Sawyer tried to strangle her, she, like, took off and Jack went looking for her. And then uh, they had their little thing and then she just started kissing Jack. I don't get it. That kiss kind of came out of nowhere as well. Um, yeah. So, I don't know. Um, ja uh, John showed um, Michael and Echo the film. That makes no sense. 
And um, Echo was being really weird about it, but apparently he found the rest of the film in the location they were at. So he brought it to John. And so they um, watched it and it said not to use the computer for communication because it could lead to another incident. What fucking incident? It still didn't really, still didn't explain anything. Just said, don't use the computer for outside communication. Uh, so, uh, Michael was fiddling around with everything. And for some reason, the computer started talking to him. Um, and it's claiming to be Walt, which I sort of saw coming. Uh, doesn't mean it is Walt, but I don't know if he's going to think that his, that it is his son or they're trying to pretend like it's like it's his son or he thinks his son's dead and communicating him through a computer. I don't know. No clue. Um, I don't know who it is. I wouldn't think it'd be the others considering how surprised a uh, good one looked when the, um, Tail end survivors. I don't know what you call them. I think I think someone told me the, the tailies or something. Anyway, uh, Anna Lucia and Echo and them found that uh, shelter and another part of the Dharma uh, thing. Uh, he looked surprised to see it. So I don't think he knows. I don't think the others know about Dharma. Maybe. I don't know. I'm surprised. I don't know. So anyway, um, also they mentioned Desmond. Um, I'm kind of wondering if we we'll see him again. Um, I'm assuming that we will because I've seen some comments in past videos of people talking about uh, loving Desmond and everything, which um, would indicate to me that, you know, he'll be back at some point. He's going to come back. And that's sort of a spoiler for me, I'm going to say. Um, I mean, I'm glad you guys love who you love. Um, but telling me that you love somebody who's not on the show currently and was just like one episode kind of spoils the fact that they're going to come back and maybe be somebody I'm going to end up loving. I want to come to that on my own. So... Anyway, just for future reference for you guys. Um, I'm not mad about it or anything. Just just going to put that out there just so you guys know. Other than that, we didn't really see too much of anything else. Trying to think what else we saw this episode. I mean, there was that whole thing at the... Toward the beginning when Jack was taking care of Sawyer. And Sawyer's like, where is she? And Jack's like, who, Kate? And he's like, I love her. And I'm like... Why? <laughs> you barely know her. So I just don't see. Because they haven't really spent like alone time together. Yeah, they've had a, like little interactions here and there. Like when they were doing that um, game that they did to get to know each other. And found out they both killed someone. But they haven't really had like any kind of romantic interaction. So how can he be in love with Kate? So, like, their whole relationship of them supposedly being love um, doesn't make sense to me right now. It just doesn't. They haven't had any romantic interactions. It just looks and uh, mostly they're fighting with each other. So, I don't know. I don't know. Um, but, yeah. So, anyway. Um, this episode was Okay. Wasn't one of my favorites, but, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. If you did, please give this video a like. If you have any suggestions on anything you'd like me to react to, please leave that down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.